after consecutive L after L after L, people around us just all dying. Seemingly, we just got a dub. Technically, Toto dead his hand cut off. Like, he cut it off himself. Boogie Woogie is done. But it doesn't matter because Maito is also done. And someone said, someone mentioned a really funny thing in the comment section. It literally said, Yuji is bullying a literal one-year-old, which is kind of true because Maito, you know, he, he looks like he's a grown-up, but technically he's like a one-year-old curse. And now, Not Ghetto has finally shown up at the end to help my, uh, Maito. But think about it. Ghettos are not Ghetto's powers. It involves like stealing curses, right? And using it as own. He's like a Pokemon trainer. So I feel like Maito is about to get sucked up. Let's begin today's reaction. The the suit guy, right? Yeah, this guy. 100% guarantee you, he's just stalling. He's just hiding because he wants to get out of this alive and not do any work, which is incredibly based. I love this character. Damn. There's a rift between our faction. I mean... <laughs> I mean, okay, this, is, this is pretty fucked up. And I'm obviously on, on the side of Yuji. But if you think about it, if you really think about it, what just happened between Panda and this guy? They were literally just fighting. And then Skuna shows up out of nowhere with fucking Gojo's... Sorry, Jogo's meteor. And Skuna says, nobody fucking move. If you move, I will kill you. He trolled them. And then he let them go at the last point one second. He terrified everybody. He killed everybody. So technically, this is the logical take to be making. But like, obviously, no one's going to be actually on his side. Like, we're all on Yuji's side. What's going on here? Nesan? Big sis? And who's in bed? Oui, oui. Lil bro! <laughs> Yo. Hot take, maybe hot take. There's a lot of fucking incest in anime. We've seen the regular Magic High School, which recently ended on our channel. A lot of fucking anime. But the, the incest. But usually the incest is like, there's a big brother and a little sister. That seems to be the common meta in Japanese anime, right? Big bro, little sis. And I don't really, I'm not a big fan, right? That, that kind of trope is like, like B tier or C tier for me. It's like, I, I, I'll accept it. I think there's some funny moments that could happen from it. But if it's flipped around, if it's a little bro and big sister, now I'm thinking, hold up, hold the fuck up, let's fucking go. Oh, this is improper. Not at all, big sister. Oh. Are you fucking serious? That was fucking instant, dude. Did you see this? The frame fucking perfect. Who called? I can't read Japanese. Why did I even fucking replay this? Someone's calling. That was so fast, though. Just instant snap. What the fuck? This little brother is so lucky, dude. So They're in Malaysia. How the fuck are they in Malaysia? K with Wee Wee's technique. Or I, I don't know. Maybe it's kind of crazy transportation. Are, are those stocks? Oh, because, you know, money. Because she's all about the money. Is Japan going to shit? Like, she knows immediately? Japan's going to tank? Sell everything? Get the fuck out? She's in Malaysia instead of Nanami said. Did Nanami specifically mention that the beach that he wanted to go to was in Malaysia? I think he did right before he died, right? Oh my god, dude. They're fuck the author is trolling us. Holy shit. Ui Ui is the luckiest motherfucker. Oh, sorry. Sister fucker. Who is her informant? What the fuck? Okay, Toto was just... Okay, no, it wasn't. No, sorry, sorry. This is back. This is, yeah, he was having delusions. But I don't even know what that dream was, but Yuji was at the dinner table. Okay, not Ghetto is here. So, like, not Ghetto is definitely gonna use, you know, throw his fucking Pokeball, right? He's gonna capture Maito, right? A Pokeball incoming? Maybe this is a Shadow Ball. Never mind. This summoning ability is fucking so broken. And the craziest thing is, this isn't even not Ghetto's real power. Because this is Ghetto's power. Right? Like, what does not get to you? Can what, what can he uniquely do? Other than fucking take over people's brains and shit and... I don't know. I missed something there. What'd he say? Yeah. He would have won instead of Okotsu. This is Yuta? If his forces hadn't been divided across the Kyoto and Shinjuku during the last year's Night's Paradise of 100 Demons, this is the last year's Shinjuku incident, right? Maybe I'm capping, but if Okotsu is Yuta... Then there's the opponent that Yuta was fighting that is getting incredibly hyped up right now in Foreshadow. Who is he, though? <laughs> he knew! Maito knew! Hey, hey, at least he tried, right? At least he tried. Bye-bye! 
Okay, he should have won was actually Geto. Okay, got it, got it. Bye-bye, <laughs> Maito. He's now just Geto's Pokemon, huh? What's oh, a lot of hands. I don't even feel sorry for this fucker. He deserves that and more. But like, now that he's been absorbed by not Ghetto, when he comes back There's to fight for him, will he be like stronger? Let's create up a Pokemon master, dude. What is his goal? Jogo used that before, right? Jogo, yeah, Supreme Art, the Meteor. Uzumaki, Naruto? Like him, Ghetto again. It's kind of creepy. It's kind of creepy. He keeps referring to himself as him, but but like he is not him, you know. And he's like an ancient sorcerer, right? Based on the way that he was talking before, their technique is extracted. So now he eats Maito, and now he can use Maito's technique. Yeah, what that throat doing? A throat goat, not Ghetto. Swallowed in one gulp. Who are you talking to? You skipped some other. <gasps> Kyoto gang! <laughs> they finally showed up. Okay. Before we get to started, I have no faith in any of the Kyoto gang except Todo Aoi. Especially not Maki's sister with her fucking pistol, bro. I, what are these dudes gonna do? Okay, this guy's pretty cool. Yeah, his family technique with the blood and shit, yes. But like, are you serious? At this stage of the game, you're gonna bring in the Kyoto gang that's been fucking benched against not Ghetto, bro? Come on. Come on, dude. Oh, God. Oh, God. Bro didn't even move. Dude, he didn't even move! Like, what is your gun gonna do? Okay, like, look, okay, cool. She got a sniper rifle. This is the dumbest thing in this fucking anime. Everyone using cursed techniques. Jogo summoning a fucking meteor. Gojo has infinite, like, Mugen. People can't even touch him. Blue and fucking red or something. He's fucking mixing colors and causing fucking spiritual energies. This bitch has a fucking gun! And guns never work in anime! You really think at this stage of the game, a gun, a bullet is the thing that's gonna fucking snipe get, get to- Okay, maybe you could say that the pellets are fucking infused with cursed energy so it's stronger. Ah, that, fuck that shit, dude! I don't This girl trash. Trash. He catches it. Toji- Okay. <laughs> Toji didn't work with the gun was on a fucking normal hu- not a normal human, but it was a regular fucking high school, middle school girl, dude. Technically, she was like a host of something crazy, but you know what I mean. Uh, whose dialogue? Oh, mi- mi- uh, mi- 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 blue hair girl, Miwa? Miwa. <laughs> okay, Miwa! I do love Miwa's design, though. I love the whole battle! Let's go! It's in the zone! Usually, she's so not confident! This is one of the sickest and like I don't care if he caught the blade. I think Miwa is still sick, her design I mean. But the power could definitely use more, you know. No, not on her! You're gonna drop a Supreme Art on her! <laughs> Maito, right? Mui Tempen? He can extract the technique right now, right? You didn't have to ult on her! <laughs> no! Bro, that's overkill! What just happened? I wasn't sure what completely happened there. Someone saved her, right? Who was that? Suit! This guy! Hey, she's there too. Maybe I've been, you know, shitting on the suit guy team. No, I've been a fan of the suit guy. This guy's incredibly base, but this guy just fucking stopped. A Supreme Art? Uzu yeah, why the fuck did he just use Uzumaki on Miwa? Let's see that again. This is fucking insane. We just talked about how insane the Supreme Art is. And look, and think about the context here. This is Miwa. She's like one of the lowest tier sorcerers that ever existed in this fucking show. And she's about to fight not Ghetto in this endgame stage. And bro drops a fucking Supreme Art. Uzumaki. Like... Uzumaki. Of all the fucking characters to do it on... <laughs> You used it on me, what, dude? <laughs> Let it be known that when Fushiguro was about to summon, like, summon Makura, he did this multiple times to, like, anybody. Anytime a fucking fly landed on him, Fushiguro was like, it's time, is it now to summon it? <laughs> this is kind of the same shit. <laughs> I can't believe he fucking dropped it on her. <laughs> so if this touched her, she would have just, like, exploded, right? 
and then boom she gets saved it's kind of hard to tell exactly what happened too scared of goat was potential <laughs> can you now say that miwa was acknowledged by the ancient sorcerer not ghetto and survived the supreme arts uzumaki one of the few to ever survive a supreme art and even got recognition from not ghetto by saying a new shadow style huh can, can that be said i think so guys i think miwa just went to fucking her power scaling just fucking skyrocketed dude holy shit <laughs> Okay, suit guy Kasakave. Kasakave kind of goaded here. Wait, what the fuck? What's going on with you? Is he constipated? I think he's just getting excited because Yuji's around. Round two? Round two. <laughs> Fucking flashback time. Alright, flashback time. A curse made her mom pregnant. And a man. Ho! 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 Wait, wait, this is an important flashback! Mom? And the man who mixed his blood into the affair mixed is is is, Cho, is, is not Ghetto Choso's stepdaddy daddy then? Not get no no no, but he has the mark. He has the mark in his in his head, right? He has the mark in his head. He does have that you know the H word stash, but this is what not Ghetto was possessing in the past. And then he swapped bodies. He swapped bodies to get to his body. But what's her name, though? He's straight up your daddy. Kamo. Yeah, your family. Yeah, you. The stain on the Kamo clan. All of history? I think beyond 150. Maybe even a thousand, dude. Ancient sorcerer. How dare you kill Itadori, my little brother, because of the fucking, the, the schizo spaghetti scene, eating scene that they were doing. Hold on, where, where are we going with this? Oh wait, Skuna's boyfriend, Sku, Skuna's fanboy boyfriend. I find this fucking big broken dude, that's our, that's our big brother now. We had Toto's a big bro, we had chosen now too. What the fuck is going on? Don't worry, you have Yuji now. <laughs> Yuji can be your brother. And he started fucking freaking out and had a spaghetti flashback. Is my brother? Where are we going with this? He's just complete schizo, right? Am I crazy, guys? I feel incredibly stupid right now because I'm not keeping up with whatever delusion Chozo is going through. But he's basically saying, I can feel strong emotional connection whenever people related to blood of me is getting hurt or whatever's happening. When my brothers were dying, when Yuji was fucking them up, I felt that. But whenever Yuji is about to die, I felt that too. Therefore, he is my younger brother. Uh-huh. Where, where, where are we going with this? I don't know. Alright, big bro. Same as the camo, right? It'll explain later it better. I'm confused, dude. So many different families involved. Okay. Dude, Skinner's fanboy made it so good. You know, he's kind of like Nouvellet from Genshin Impact, huh? Just fucking charge beam, just hydro beam. I hope that was a special grade. It'd be very impressive. Choso's long range game is actually goaded. But then he also has like a mid and a short range game too. See, here's the melee range. And you can use it as a foothold to fucking fly. Whoa, 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 okay, did he just fucking dislocate his head? What the fuck, look at this. Boom, look at the wrist. This is not normally, guys. This is not normally. What the fuck is going on here? That might've been the coolest moment. Dude, his like melee taijutsu is busted. And I'm talking about Ghetto, sorry, not Ghetto. <laughs> How is he the younger brother, though? <laughs> that was one of the funniest laughs. Listen to that laugh again. <laughs> Listen to this laugh, he's like... <laughs> yeah, you're strangers, right? How are you brothers? <laughs> I don't get it, dude. 
Uh, no, 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 no. Toto is just a schizo. Choso is, I'm not sure. Be careful, Panda. Oh, Mr. Suit Guy going in too. We got the Kyoto gang too, yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Skuna's fanboy maid? So Skuna's fanboy maid's power is like ice? God damn it. I mean, if Skuna acknowledges him, he's clearly busted, right? Immediately just sealed everybody. That was that easy. What the fuck? That guy's still one of the most relatable characters. He just wants to go home. Ice bullet? Ice bullet? Yuji saves his big brother! Oh! Skuna's fanboy mate probably can't hurt Yuji because it's like Skuna's like body, right? What are you talking about? Oni sama. Oni sama. Where's Miyuki at? Let's get real. Let's let's replay this sequence of events right here and tell me. Did you guys really think that this broom fucking girl from Kyoto was going to use an attack and hurt Skuna's fanboy maid and not get to Rhino, who are seemingly one of the most endgame bosses that we have developed? What the fuck are you going to do with the wind sight? <laughs> it was like, yo, where's Maki's sister at? Why is she shooting right now? Is she out of bullets? Yo! Skuna Fanboy made his popping off! We're gonna die and then? Somebody saved us, but who? What kind of plot armor was that? Todo Sensei? The, the, the woman that started! What kind of woman do you like? Tall girl! Big ass! Oh shit, she's back! She's back! Not get to recognize her too. Holy shit, dude, fucking back! She's fucking back, dude! Holy shit! Maybe there's hope for Toto after all, because I was really scared, guys. I was super scared that Toto was gonna die, and his hands cut off, and it's looking pretty bad. Boogie Woogie's done. But, like, right now, it's looking kind of okay. Don't spoil me. Don't give me sus emotes. But I'm just on that next level of cope right now. Mei Mei Hu, you're right. You know, this this woman right here, she is goddamn. Like, she started the whole tall girl with the big-ass meme from Toto, huh? This is actually so good. Is there a post credit scene? There isn't. Goddamn, dude. I think this episode, it was... Okay. <laughs> the fucking... <laughs> the fucking Mei Mei and Ui Ui C. <laughs> Double incest. Double incest. That was actually good. The Uzumaki revelation from Nageto. This is cracked. The, again, this guy is like Im almost like immortal, just like transferring, swapping between bodies. Can fucking is a Pokemon master, but now can become the Pokemon himself by extracting their power using Uzumaki, right? Fucking the revel- Okay, Goat Miwa. Goat Miwa, right? Let's, let's get real, guys. Goat Miwa, right? She fucking withstood the supreme art. And she fucking taught not get to an ancient sorcerer of vast wisdom what new shadow style was. Panda's back? Kusakabi the Sukai? Kinda clutching. Insane revelation that Choso's daddy was technically not get to as well. But then- Somehow, because Choso can feel deeply within his bones about how Yuji feels, suddenly Choso is our older brother, so now we have Toto Aoi, the fucking god of schizophrenia. This guy's on that next delusional level, but it's fine because he's Toto. And then now we have Choso doting over his younger brother that was actually fucking out of nowhere and hilarious. There's also the Kamo thing too, huh? The biggest stain on the Kamo history, the worst sorcerer ever. And finally, Skuna's femboy maid is actually busted. This ice power, he immediately restricted everybody. And the only person that could have stopped Skuna's femboy maid is Toto's master. What's her name again? Yuki Skumo. And if you look at Naketo's face when saying this, it sounds personal. He seems actually pissed off. He seems kind of worried. So she might be her. She might be her, guys. Yo, we have one more episode before the finale next Thursday. We will be there to watch it with the suit on. But goddamn, things are ramping up to a boiling point. But hey, 
if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for more content, and until next time, take care.